My name is Laura Alt and I'm a research assistant at the Briere Research Institute. So the current project I'm working on is with respect to keeping person with dementia safe in their home and detects wandering and hopefully diverts them from making an exit, which will then help relieve some stress off of their caregiver. So underneath there is a pressure sensitive bed mat and as a person with dementia gets out of bed, their bedside lamp will turn on as well as the bathroom lighting guiding them to the bathroom. When they are finished, they will ideally go back to bed such that when they go back into the bed, everything turns off. If they are to sort of divert from this path that we've set out, there will be motion sensors in the house that are placed around to sort of um, alert the person that's caring for them, their caregiver, if they are moving towards the exit. We also have a speaker that has a verbal message played sort of reminding the person with dementia, you know, if they were to enter, enter the kitchen, it can say, you know, something like, honey, it's the middle of the night, please come back to bed. And that will typically bring them back to bed. If that fails, we have these contact sensors on the doorway, and if they are open, then a text message can be sent to the caregiver's phone, waking them up and then telling them, you know, the person with dementia has exited through the front door or the back door, depending. And so the person, the caregiver is able to sleep knowing that they are only going to get woken up if they need to bring their person with dementia back inside. Ideally, we would like to put together a you know wandering detection and diversion kit uh, with some industry partners, you know, working out what technology we want to use, you know, what motion sensors work best, and make it so that this kit can be easily purchased and then easily installed for um, those who maybe aren't as technologically uh, gifted as the younger generation and that way they don't need anybody going in and installing and they can just do it all themselves. So ideally it would be put into the market, um, but we've just got to continue testing to make sure it's actually doing what we want it to do.